Setting up the Thermoguard HQ system takes three to five minutes. Setup guides are located on the machine for reference. Ensure you have all the equipment to start. Plug the Thermoguard HQ into the wall socket and turn on the console. Rotate the dial to make a selection and push to confirm. Choose the treatment settings according to the desired application and in line with your hospital's own protocols. Select the intended treatment. Select Mode. Select Yes if this is a new patient. Select a target temperature. Get the startup kit. Remove the catheter deflation syringe bag and hang it on the console hook. Peel open the startup kit. Lift the kit out of the tray. Open the top cover of the console. Lift the well cap and place the coil into the coolant well. Close the cap, passing the tubes through the slit. Place the air trap in the orange stand with the orange end down. Orange number two to orange number two. Now open the roller pump lid. Fully insert the tubing disc into the orange slot, number three, pressing it down. Orange three to orange three. Turn the blue pump knob very firmly counterclockwise while feeding in the tube. Press the blue end of the tubing so it's fully in the groove. Spike the 500 milliliter saline bag. Ensure the spike fully extends into the bag and hang the bag onto the console hook. Close the roller pump lid. Press and release the button labeled Prime, blue number five. The button will light up. After five seconds, the pump light will come on and the pump will turn for two minutes to prime the tubing. Confirm the pinwheel turns and there's a steady flow of saline in the tubing. If bubbles continue to circulate after two minutes, recheck the previous steps. Once the startup kit has completely filled with saline, place the air trap, blue end down, into the blue chamber, blue six to blue six. Check to ensure the tubing is correctly aligned and close the console top cover. Console setup is now complete. Place the catheter using the standard Seldinger technique. Now connect the startup kit tubing to the catheter. Place the temperature probes one of three ways, esophageal, rectal, or fully. Connect the primary temperature probe to the adapter cable. Then plug the adapter cable into the T1 port. When connecting a second temperature probe to the ThermoGuard HQ, repeat the steps and use the T2 port. Double check the target temperature and mode the system is now on standby. To take it out of standby, press the play button. The ThermoGuard HQ system is actively treating the patient.